Hey, I got some more special surprises for you tonight. So make sure you tap in, okay? Make sure you tap in. Come on, y'all. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Let's go, BBK gang. Let me get everything set up and ready to go. Let me set this up right quick. I know I said 8 o'clock. You guys, for everybody that follow us on Instagram, and I do apologize that I am officially uh, 17 minutes late, but I had to feed the dogs, and I had to help Bay out with something very important that y'all are going to love. So make sure that you stay tuned. And hey, I got I got some I got some surprises for y'all tonight. Got some big surprises for y'all tonight. Let me get I'm getting everything set up on the uh computer. I'm on my phone, but I'm getting everything set up on the computer. Give me one second, you guys. Okay. Now Let's get them, get them likes up, get them likes up, get them up, get them up, get them up, BBK gang. Let's get them up. I got eight people in here. I got two likes. Oh yeah. Let's get them up, get them up, get them up. So, uh oh. What are you doing, little girl? Hold on, y'all. Let me get her situated right quick. Hold on. Well, okay, you guys. So I'm going to go ahead and start. I ain't going to hold y'all long. But as y'all already know, if you saw the live on Monday, they got their tails docked. They're doing excellent. As you can see, they fighting over nipples. Hey, and y'all see in five days time, four, whatever, however you want to look at it, how big they've gotten. This is Ciroc, y'all. This is Ciroc. But this ain't the surprise. I got something else for you. Oh, Lord. Man. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Y'all see what's going on. Good mama, good mama. Y'all see what's going on. Oh, Lord. Get up here. Uh, hold on, y'all. She done flipped back over again. Hold on, y'all. Lay back. Thank you. Thank you. Sorry, y'all. Okay. All right. So, yeah, as y'all can see, they done got their tails docked. Got their declaws, had their first little checkup, and they are doing excellent day. Oh, yeah. So, I'm doing real good. But that's only part of the surprise, y'all. That's only part of the surprise. I got to go outside. Let me cut this uh, on her right quick. So let's let's take it outside. Let's take it outside. Y'all see the gang over there? Got the lights on. They just finished eating. I'm putting my boots on, y'all. Ah, okay. All right, BBK gang, y'all tap in. Keep hitting that like button. Keep hitting that like button. Y'all, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Let's get it, BBK gang. Talk to me. Y'all already know what time it is. It's Friday Night Live time. Let y'all see them. Let's see if anybody can notice what's missing. 
Oh, I will say, since I'm outside now, it's a little disclaimer, but y'all, the wind is very hot today. So if it's some wind, y'all, I do apologize. If it's a little shaky, I do apologize. But the wind has been very, very hot today. But let's get it cracking. Let's get it cracking. I'm going to go over here. Let's see. What's going on, Raphael? What's going on? Oh, yeah, y'all. Oh, yeah. Today has been a good, good, good day. A long, but good day. BBK Gang, if you ready to know what's going on, y'all got to hit that BBK Gang in the comments. I want to see BBK Gang in the comments. If y'all ready for the real surprise, if you're ready for the real, real surprise, make sure you hit that. Just make sure, You got to hit that like button. You got to tell me in the comments, BBK Gang, BBK Gang. Y'all, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. It's like that we did the other night. If I don't get enough BBK gangs in the comments, I'm going to prolong the surprise. But I want y'all to see it. So y'all come on oh, and yeah. hit that BBK gang. Oh, yeah, BBK gang in the comments. Come oh, on, y'all. Come on. I got, I see. Over, oh, yeah. I see. Oh, there it go. What's going on, daddy? Y'all in the comments. My dad is in the comments. Mr. O. Jackson Jr., that's my dad. Hey, dad. About time you join the live. <laughs> my dad is in the comments, y'all. Come on, BBK gang. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's get it going. Let's get it going. Got a lot of things popping up. Hey, we got, hey, y'all heard Bay. I ain't going to put him on camera because he a little tired. <laughs> Bay been doing his thing today. But come on, y'all. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. I got, I, I see him. I see him. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Come on, keep it going. Keep it going. Keep it going, BBK gang. Y'all ready for the surprise? Hey, put put 100s in the, in the comments. Put that BBK 100 in the comments. If y'all ready, put that BBK gang no, 100 in the comments. Y'all keep on. Come on, come on. Let's go, let's go, let's go. I want to show y'all. It's, 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 it's killing me. I, I'm ready to flip the camera around so y'all can see what I see right now. Because, boy, boy, hey, this has been a wonderful week. Look at my daddy. He put me, look, 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 look. Right there. You see it? <laughs> <laughs> daddy. <laughs> okay, dad. Okay, dad. All right, y'all. I'm going to go ahead and flip it so y'all can see what I see. Hold on. I'm going to turn this way because I got to cut my, cut my light on. So y'all can uh really see. All right, y'all ready, Kane? Y'all ready? Bam! Woo! Y'all see what's going on, BBK gang? It's been a heck of a week, but hey, it paid off on this good, good, good Friday. Y'all see what's going on? Y'all see it? Y'all see what's going on? Oh, yeah. Nikki had her pups. And, man, talking about massive. Ma talking about massive. Talking about look good. Oh, yeah, it's just a sneak peek. It's just a sneak peek. It's just a sneak peek. Oh, yeah, I will say, don't ask me. I'm not going to tell y'all how many right now. I'm not going to tell you how many right now. <laughs> So don't ask me how many. I'm not going to tell you right now. I'm not going to tell you right now. But appreciate that, Sergeant Jones. Appreciate that. Thank you. Puppies, oh, yeah. Lots Just know we got a lot of things going on right now over here at BBK. And, hey, it's a blessing. Everybody is doing wonderful. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. I hope you uh, everybody's tuning in. I might give you another sneak peek before I go back in the house. But, uh, let's see. You missed it. You just tuning in. Y'all see what's going on. You see it. You see it. Oh, yeah. She just had them today, y'all. She just had them today. 
All day, man. All, all day thing. All day, man. All, literally, all day from the time we got up yeah. to, what, a few hours ago? She uh, had them around by 6. I mean, she been having these puppies all day. Since 6 this morning? Yeah. And she just finished a and few she, hours she ago. She just finished like two hours ago. Yeah, she just finished about two hours ago. Everybody's doing good. Everybody's healthy. Hey, we can't complain. She did her thing. She did her thing. Did her Zion, thing. I see you, boy, boy. I see you, BBK gang. I know you You tapping in. Go on and get back to work. I know you at work. <laughs> I know you at work. So go on and tap in and, and, and go on and get back to work, man. Y'all see what's going on. She tired. She so tired, she snoring. <laughs> I knew it, Zaya. I know it. <laughs> Tell him hey, Nikki Nikki. Tell him hey, Nikki Nikki. <laughs> she tired, y'all. She tired. She tired. But yeah, gang. Y'all see what's going on. Hey, it's been it's been it's been a a great, great week. Not just the day, but it's been a great week. It's been a great week, but been a tired week. Oh yeah, tired. we man, we tired. We we super tired. We got two litters literally at the same time on the ground. Y'all see how big Trump puppies is already? Oh yeah, I told them. Just in just in you know four days, four days time, they are humongous. I'm gonna go back in the house, y'all, cause like I said, it's windy, so y'all can hear me. So anybody that, you know, want to ask anything, don't ask me how many they each had. You just have to stay tuned for that. You just have to stay tuned for that. But I'm going to go back in the house, y'all. So, um, like I said, so it won't be so windy. So y'all can hear me and probably see me better, too. But, yeah, if you're new to the channel or just stopping by and you haven't hit that subscribe button, Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Turn your post notification bell on the all. Keep like, loving these videos. Drop a comment if you like. Share these videos, of course. And you already know. Tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend to come join the BBK gang family. Also, y'all keep getting your raffle tickets. Keep getting your raffle tickets. Keep getting your raffle tickets. Because we almost there, and it's almost that time to give somebody this pup. So make sure y'all keep doing that, keep doing that, keep doing it. Put this light on so y'all can see me. Yeah. So yeah, BBK gang. So tell me what y'all think. Tell me what y'all think so far. I know I sprung it on y'all this week with the surprises, but you already know we had to do it. We had to let the gang know what's going on. Had to, and it's crazy, y'all. If y'all saw the video that we just posted today that we did yesterday of us giving Nikki a bath and giving the other dogs a bath, we just literally did that yesterday. So... It was just, hey, we just knew, we felt that it was time. We thought she was going to have them uh, next week sometime. But, you know, hey, she said she was ready. The pup said that they was ready. So they came on out today. But that, it, it's, it's, a, it's a blessing to have both of them drop in the same week. That way, you know, we can kind of. Manage both of them at the same time and, and you know, just get it over with it. Um, so we can end up getting some rest. Probably in about two more weeks, we'll be able to get a little bit more rest. But, you know, me and Babe, we do this as a team. We tag team it. Um, hey, he go to sleep for a couple of hours and I'm up making sure all the puppies are eating, making sure the mom's is good, making sure, you know, they go out to use the restroom when they have to go out. Um, just making sure all the pups are getting um, fed, everything. So 
You know, it's a job. It's not just about selling dogs. It's about loving the dogs. Just making sure that everybody is taken care of. Even, you know, the ones that are having puppies, the ones that aren't having puppies. It, I mean, it's a job, y'all. And, and it's, a, it's a lot of work. It's very time consuming. And you have to be able to accommodate all of them. So, you know, it's a job. It's not all peaches and cream. So, hey, it's a lot of it's a lot of work that goes into this. Y'all talk to me, talk to me. It's like y'all wanted to see the surprise and then y'all left me hanging. What's going on, gang? Y'all talk to me. Y'all not is uh, y'all not liking the surprise? I mean, what's going on? Y'all talk to me. Talk to me. Thank you, Laura. Thank you. Thank you. Y'all talk to me. What's going on? It's Friday. Y'all, you already know. Hey, if you if you drink, go take you a shot, make you a glass, whatever. Get you some wine, whatever you do. Uh, uh, if you don't uh, drink and you put a little something in the earth, go get you some, put it in the earth. If you don't do that, hey, that's all good too. But hey, y'all just tap in with us. Y'all show us some love tonight. Because last Friday, I ain't gonna lie, BBK gang, y'all kind of disappointed me. Y'all kind of hurt in my heart. Because y'all wasn't... Y'all wasn't, you know, tapped in with me like y'all normally do. Which is, I mean, I understand other things was going on probably that day or whatever the case may be. But y'all y'all show more love to us than than what, what we got last Friday. I'm going to tell you that much. But y'all talk to me. Talk to me, gang. Talk to me. I let y'all see the pups. Um, Like I said, I'm not going to go back outside right now. Uh, Sorak is in here with me, so I probably will show her again with her babies. But I'm not going to go back outside right now because of the simple fact um, the wind is blowing. <laughs> Tamara, what you talking about? <laughs> I'm confused. I'm confused. I, I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> but yeah, BBK gang, like, it's been a good week. Um, it's a blessing to have just, you know, to be a part of bringing life into the world. Um, I, just, I, 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 get a, I get a joy out of, out of it. Each time we do it, um, so some people might might think it's is is kind of gruesome or whatever. Oh yeah, <laughs> oh yeah, Duchess, you talking about Mister uh, Mister Eddie's dog? Yeah, she yeah, I don't know. She I guess she wanted to be camera shy. And didn't wanna uh didn't wanna be on camera. As soon cause before I cut the camera on, she was looking right at me. And then as soon as I cut it on and zoomed in on it, she just turned her head. So <laughs> so yeah, she's something else. <laughs> Fred, I don't know to be honest. I I don't know. Um I mean, like I say, they're both still fresh. Um, we, we, we don't know yet. Um, so yeah. Uh, Super Tez, I'm not sure yet. It just depends on when we, when we get to 10K. I, I can't, I can't tell you, but we do have, we'll, of course y'all know we'll have Black Cherry having her pups soon. Well, she still got, you know, about a good month and a half. Um, and then we'll have, we have Roxy coming up, uh, she'll be coming in heat, and then we'll have Chanel coming in heat, uh, soon also, and those are going to Mo3, so it just, it, I, I can't, I can't tell you, but I just know who we got coming back up in heat, um, hopefully around that time, but as y'all know, the three, uh, yeah, these three girls, Black Cherry, Ciroc, and, um, Nikki and Trina will not be a part of that because they just had, well, Trina, 
Ciroc and Nikki just had their baby, so it's going to be a few months before they even back in heat. And um, Black Cherry is pregnant at the moment. No, he, everybody everybody chose their own name. That was the name that uh, he chose for her. Everybody picked their own name. We don't we don't name them at all. That was their name that they had for her, and that was Duchess. So, yeah. But yeah, everybody and um, also want to give a shout out uh, on live to Kingpin Kingpin Kennels Transportation LLC. He is on um, Instagram. Y'all go check him out. Um, thank you, JJ, for all the the help and the services that you provided for us. This is the second time we actually shipped the dog, and each time he's came on time, he's delivered the pups to their new owners on time and with care. And I just want to give a shout out to him and tell him thank you from Big Boss Rock Wallet Kennels. We appreciate you so much. And of course, you know, we're going to be doing some more business as long as we're in business. Um, and also want to thank everybody that came and got their uh, pup. Uh, it was a wonderful experience meeting everybody. Uh, it, it, it went smooth as can be. Uh, if you follow us on Instagram, you guys, you can also see the pictures that we posted of each person getting their dog. Only one that wasn't on the video was uh, Mr. Jerry Valdez and Miss Nicole. Uh, they were not in the video. Uh, they were the first ones to actually get their pup to go. Um, but I, we were busy that day, and y'all, I, I really forgot the day that we had planned for them to come. And luckily, we were in the back already, you know, cleaning up the kennels that particular morning. And I saw them, and I was like, oh, snap, you know. So it was like real spare the moment, and I didn't come get the camera. So, y'all, I do apologize for that. But their picture is on our Instagram page. So if you're not following us on Instagram, make sure you follow us on Instagram at Big Boss Rock Wallet Kennels. No spaces, no nothing, all one word. Uh, follow us on there. Also, um, we're on WhatsApp for people that's out of the country, um, stuff like that. You can hit us up on WhatsApp. All of that info is down in the description box of each video, including this live right here. So make sure you guys, for people that's, um, you know, coming to new to the channel, and stuff like that, and want to inquire about pups and the raffle and all of that. Make sure you check out the description box because all of our info is there. Also, it's in the video. It's at the end of the, the, the video that we've been posting lately. All of our info is at the end of the video. And I know it might go a little fast, but you can always pause it. Or, like I said, if you miss it in the video, you can always go and look in the description box. If you're watching it on your TV... Um, you have to do it from your phone, from your laptop, from your computer, or your tablet, or whatever. Because looking at it on the TV, you can't get to the uh, description box. So, anything that you guys want to know for the Moyes pricing, um, what litters we might have upcoming, um, things of that nature that I will not answer in the comments or on our lives and stuff like that, you can call us and... and DM us on Instagram, text us, anything, but I won't answer them in the comments. Also, you guys, I know a lot of people might call my husband. You might text him, stuff like that, and he doesn't respond. Y'all, he does a lot of things. Um, he, he's very busy. He's always moving around, and a lot of time he might have his phone on him, but he won't, you know, Check it at that time. Excuse me. Um, sometimes if you call he, and he's able to answer, he will. But a lot of times I know you guys have called or text him. And sometimes you call the text and you end up talking to me. That's because he's busy and I see, you know, someone's calling pertaining to the dogs. So that's what, that's what happens a lot of times. So if he doesn't respond and you guys are trying to get info or trying to put a deposit down or whatever the case may be, y'all, my number is also in the, in, the, in the information. 
So you guys can also reach out to me. And I know some guys don't really want to talk to me out of respect, which is fine. And I understand. And, you know, some people want to just talk to my husband. But you got to understand, you guys, I will answer my phone. Um, my phone is on me 24-7. So you can call me if you want information, anything that you want to know, I can answer that. Guarantee I can answer anything you want to know. Because at the end of the day, regardless, at some point in time, uh, during your process, if you do decide to move forward with us, getting a pup, you will have to talk to me anyway. So uh, you can't call me to get any information, you guys. So Tamara, Sarak has one more breeding. One more. After this one, when she comes back in heat, however many months, uh, they normally take six months, but it, it just really depends. If y'all can see, she came back in heat pretty fast. So it just really depends on the dog. She might not come back in heat that fast. But um, normally it's about, like I said, it's about six months after they've had uh, a litter that they come back in heat. So this next go round, this will be Ciroc's last breeding, you guys. This will be Ciroc's last breeding coming up. Not this one, but the next one. This will be her last one. So if you are wanting a pup from Ciroc before we stop breeding her and put her into retirement, because Ciroc, if you guys don't know, yeah, we, she still is young, but we just decided we're not gonna um breed her as much um now like i said this is the ne the le the next one is her last one but that doesn't mean later on you know we might do it one more but i know for right now she's this is going to be her last one um so if you're wanting something off of Ciroc, make sure you get on that now because after that no more breeding of Ciroc. It'll be everybody else's turn to breed. Because if you don't know, like I said, Ciroc will be four next year. So we just don't, like I said, we just don't want her to... You know how you see a dog and that has had pups, a few litters, and their titties and stuff are sagging and hanging and stuff like that? We don't want that look for her. We want her to still look good and not just look like she done had about 15, 20 litters. You know what I'm saying? So we still want her to live her life. Um, so, yeah. Even though she started late on her pregnancies and everything, but we still want her to have a good life, not just being pregnant, if that makes sense, you guys. I see you, Kia. I see you, Kia. Oh, yeah. I, I, I believe you. So... In the comments, y'all, y'all see Kia Evans. She is uh, one of the ones that came and got her big girl. Um, they originally named her Trinette, uh, but she ended up changing it that same day that she got her to Indica. So her name is Indica, and she has a girl from us. that uh, Her and her husband was... Uh, I do Key, you know, and tell him, don't be mad at me, but I do not know your husband's name. I just, because I've always talked to you, so I don't know his name, even though we speak every time we've t uh, we've talked and everything up until. But I do not know his name, and tell him again, I, I do apologize. <laughs> but he, the, they're the ones, um, it, it, uh, it said Mrs. Black. Blackburn, Mr. and Mrs. Blackburn in the, uh, Blackman. I'm sorry, Blackburn. Why am I, I'm just messing up everything. Mr. and Mrs. Blackman in the, uh, on the video. So that's them. This is who I'm talking to right now. So you guys, like, it's, it's, it's been nothing but love. And I think Ciroc has gotten up. I think she might have to use the restroom, you guys. So give me one second. Let me go let Ciroc out so she can use the restroom and everything, and I'll be right back. So y'all don't go nowhere. Give me two minutes. Not even two minutes. Give me one minute, and I'll be right, right back.
All right, gang, I'm back, I'm back, I'm back, I'm back, I'm back. Hopefully, didn't too many people leave. Um, but yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay, Kim. Tell me I said I'm sorry. <laughs> and don't hold me to that. Okay, so y'all, Sorak is outside using the restroom. So this is probably the best time so y'all can really see the babies. As y'all can see, they fat, fat fool. I got to change this so y'all don't worry about this. I'm going to change this before Sorak comes back in. I'm going to let her stay out there for a second. Matter of fact, I really could change it right now while she's not in here. I'm going to move them out the way. I change this uh, twice a day. You know, just to, um, you know, because the puppies do poop. They do pee, even though, you know, she does, uh, you know, clean them. But, of course, you you still going to get it regardless. And then um, her just coming in and out. And, you know, she's still kind of, you know, bleeding a little bit from having, excuse me, having her baby. So, I just, we just want to, because the plan was not to have them in the house like this. We plan to have something else set up for them. But, Tin House, it's in a smaller, air, well, big enough area, but smaller area. Um, we have them, we have her in the washroom. We will be bringing um, Nikki in shortly after, uh, probably after we get off this live. I'm going to go help Bay clean her up and everything. Um, and then we're going to bring them in the house for the night. Uh, we're not going to have her in here with Sarah. We have to wait because I don't know how Nikki is going to react to being, you know, because some dogs, when they have babies and even though they know the other dog and everything and they're comfortable and stuff like that, but when they have babies, they're real overprotective. So we don't know if. You know how Nikki's going to react just right off the bat. And Ciroc, she, I mean, she should be chill. She should be fine. But we just don't want to chance it. So she's going to, Nikki's going to sleep, is going to be in there with us in the living room. We're going to make a pallet on the floor in the living room to be with her tonight. Um, we also ordered another whelping box. We bought a whelping box this time because we just, you know, figured... You know, it's about the same price as it is to build one, to make one. I mean, to buy one. So, um, it didn't come. It was supposed to come today, Amazon. But it didn't come today. But that's okay. So, it should be here tomorrow. Um, so, once that comes, then that's where Nikki will go. Um, she'll go in there with her pups. And she'll be, you know, in there with us until they get old enough to where they Nikki and so I can go back outside with the rest of the dogs and then it'll just be the pups because y'all already know um in a few weeks we'll start winging them but right now of course you can't do nothing but let them drink because you know they babies and all they got they eyes not open their ears are not even open and they're starting Ciroc's baby's ears are starting to kind of crack but they still they can't really here just yet but yeah <laughs> Timothy you looking for the like button it should be right up under the name of the video and all that other stuff like that it should be there um Yes, for the most part, yes. Uh, there for the most part, yes. Um, we do have a few females for sale, for up, still up for grabs. So, but everybody, a few, not a lot, but a few. So, if you're you're biased and you really don't care, but you just want a good quality dog, then hey, by all means, give us a call. But at the end of the day, guys, one thing that some people, you know. Misky screw 
Like, even though you might have a female dog, and yeah, they do have their cycles. I mean, if you don't plan on breeding them, then get them fixed and you can eliminate that. But at the end of the day, even if you don't plan on breeding them, and you don't even want to spend that money, then, you know, they make, y'all, they make dog diapers. Also, they, you can, you know, if you got a yard, you can put them outside. And they, they bleed, yeah, but they don't. It's not just pouring out of them. You know what I'm saying? It drips, yeah. You might have to wipe it up a little bit, but at the end of the day, a girl dog is no better than a boy dog. I mean, they both can be protective of of their human, their owner. Um, they can still do the same thing that you want a boy dog to do. They can be a protector. They can be a worker. They can be whatever. You know what I'm saying? So... Don't be biased to the fact, to the point where, oh, I just gotta have a boy. Now, like I, like I said, I get it. Some people just like boy dogs. I mean, that's fine. But if you don't really care and you just want a good quality dog, get your girl. You still gonna have a Rottweiler. It's still gonna be quality and it's still gonna be a big dog. So it don't always have to be a boy just for it to have a big blockhead, a big body, and big, and all this other stuff, or whatever the, whatever you're looking for. The females do the same thing. Because as y'all can see, BBK is producing big females. Not just males, but big females too. Victor, I, I, Instagram is Big Boss Rock Wallet Kendall, same as our YouTube channel. Uh, no spaces, no nothing. So yeah. All right, kid, I see you. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay, Derek. Like I said, if you want to give us a call after we end the live to inquire, you know, about everything, you can um, check the description box. Like I said, you can call me or my husband. It doesn't really matter. Um, probably me, seeing how, uh, you know, he's tending to Nikki and stuff. But you can call me, um, and I can give you any information um, you want. Okay, Victor, appreciate that love. Tamara, we love it. We absolutely love it. I mean, it's just so much space. We still, because one thing about it, only thing that we haven't done on the inside, because, you know, we've been doing everything on the outside, getting everything, you know, for the dogs and just making sure that the yard is treated and just different stuff. Like, only thing we got to do now is it's time to cut the grass because it's growing. And we still you know, adding things for the dogs. Um, we still ain't break them dog on leaves, y'all, but don't don't hold that to us. I mean, we gonna get it done. But we've we've got them in an the area where we're gonna burn them. So we have done that. <laughs> but um now we're working on we gotta, you know we haven't had time to really go do anything because we had Trina's pups and now we got these two litters on the ground so once you know we get a little bit more free time for us to do you know what we want to do with the house we're going to go and get some things to decorate and stuff like that and get some more furniture and just you know make it lively but it's it's still it's coming slowly but surely oh yeah don't be a monster. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. I'm telling you, Timothy. So far, that is the plan. Um, That is the plan so far. But, you know, in a few years or whatever the case may be, um, we might expand. You just never know. And, you know, what we, you know, decide to do. But at the moment, yes, this is where we're going to be for a while. Yes. Okay, Derek. Okay, okay. I think you um you're on the side where my I have an uncle that stays on the north side. So yeah, you ain't far at all. Houston is Houston. I don't care where you is. Houston is Houston. So 
But yeah, you guys, I got my pad. Y'all can see. Fresh new pad. I'm finna move these sleeping beauties over so I can take this one off. And then I'm going to bring some rock back in in a minute. Let her stretch her legs, get her some fresh air. Um, I gotta fill her water bowl back up. She ate earlier, but um, of course I fixed her food for the night. Um, she hasn't eaten it yet because, like I said, she ate her. Excuse me, she ate her snack that she had in her bowl. Not right, not too long before I um, fed them. So I know she's not just starving, but she'll eat it when she wants to because it's in here with her. Um, Jonathan, give us a call and I can let you know all the info on it. I can let you know in more detail. Hey, you guys. I was going to ask y'all something. And this is something that me and Babe were talking about. Um, We've been talking about it for a little while now. But... What do you think, you guys? I was thinking about um, maybe not this year, maybe next year, um, going to like get my veterinary um, credentials and going to school for that. Just so, you know, because it's a lot of money taking the dogs to the vet, you know, the puppies each time and just whatever, you know what I'm saying? So we were thinking about it and talking about it. And, you know, I was like, you know what, babe? That could be a good idea. I mean, I don't mind it. Um, I think it'll be kind of fun. So what do you guys think? Should, you know, regardless, I, I'm probably still going to do it. But I just want to get you guys' input on what y'all think. Um, do you think that'll be a good idea? So, like I said, so we can, you know, give shots. We can give... Um, vaccines we can kind of diagnose and, and do more in-house versus you know going and just spending so much money at the vet when you know i don't know you know what's going on with the dog now unless i need a second opinion or something like that then of course i will you know we'll, we're going to still continue to take them to the vet but just certain things we can do in-house Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you for the input, uh, Derek. Thank you. Um, Jonathan, we feed our dogs Victor dog food, the Victor in the purple bag, and they get, and I bake them baked chicken leg quarters every day. Every day they get baked chicken mixed with their dry dog food every day. I'm sorry, here, y'all. I'm just, I'm... Moving the pups, y'all probably gonna hear them whine because I'm waking them up, moving them so I can change their little bedding. And they sleep good too, boy. Sliding and stuff. I know little stinkies. I know them wicked. And they did so good uh, the other day when they got their tail clip, y'all. They sung to me all the way home. They weren't crying, they were just singing. Because it, it, it went a little longer than I expected. Because I didn't bring some rock with me. So they were mainly kind of whiny because they were hungry, not because it hurt. So um they did really, really good. And as you can see, they're not whining. They probably gonna whine that because I don't move them because they were asleep. But um the tails look very, 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 very good. I'm very pleased with it. Um, so, there's no complaints, complaints on that. Uh, hold on, BBK gang. Hold on, little stinkies. I hear you. I hear you. You ain't gonna be down there long. I'm 
little stinkies. There you go. They also gave me jokes. Y'all eat up everything. Where you going? You can't go up the wall. Okay, got them back situated. Oh yeah, oh yeah, most definitely. Uh, I mean, you know, anything I put my mind to, for the most part, I try to execute it and, and go full fledged with it. So I know I can do it. Um, it's just a matter of doing it. <laughs> it's the matter of doing it. Yeah, I can show y'all. Uh, Ciroc babies, they whining now because I done moved them. But as y'all see, they done went back to sleep now. They done went back to sleep. Because they not hungry. They been eating all doggone day. I'm finna let Ciroc back in so she can come in here. And uh, as y'all see, she ain't ate her food. I gotta give her some more water. You probably heard him in her whining. So I gotta go, I'm gonna go fill these bottles up for her. And then bring her back in here. Ouch. But yeah, you guys, I just thought I would, excuse, I would get the game's opinion and see what y'all thought about thought about that because like I said at the end of the day I'm probably nine times out of ten still going to do it um it probably won't be this year it'll probably be next year sometime but I um I was getting some advice from one of our clients um she's actually doing the same thing but she's also a actual registered human nurse but she um she's taking up you know, she's really not doing the veterinarian part. She's doing more so like the training and stuff like that. But she was just telling me that um, regardless of which which route you want to choose, you still somewhat have to go through the whole thing. So it's like you're still learning all of that at the same time, regardless of which field you, you know, you go with. And... um so, um, I want to wait for one until, because she was saying that I would have to have, um, uh, like a, a pup or something, um, to work with, to once I do my hands-on, hands-on training and stuff like that. So, I wanted to kind of wait until we, um... Uh, we end up keeping, you know, whatever off whatever litter litter we, we plan on keeping, um, to get one and then have that pup to go through training and stuff like that with me, whatever I have to do. That way whatever um I learn I can come back and incorporate that into the big dogs. So, um that's one thing that that I would say that I'm waiting on too. Um but I'm kind of excited about it. Um, I never really thought about even doing anything like that. But when Bay brought it to my attention, I was like, you know what? That sounds like a pretty good idea. And um, I like animals. Uh, I'm afraid of snakes and spiders, I will say that. <laughs> but I, I like animals. I'm not too fond of cats, so any cat lovers, I do apologize in advance, but I don't really care for cats. But at the end of the day, you know, when you go into that field, you got to deal with all sorts of animals. Um, so, yeah. But I think, I think, I think it'll be, I think it'll be something new for me. And then also it'll be expansion of our brand, you know, of the Big Boss Rockwell and Kendall's brand. So, I don't see it being a, a bad thing to do. So, I see your lifetime grounded BBK game. 
Oh yeah, you know everybody has their their own pick. You know, some people are strictly Debo, some people are strictly Mo three, some people are just both. Um, but yeah, at the end of the day, you can't go. What are you wanting for? What are you wanting for? <laughs> what are you wanting for? What are you wanting for, little one? You're not hungry. I know you're not. What are you wanting for? What are you wanting for? What are you wanting for? Everybody that down here sleeping. You down here crying. I'm finna bring you mama back in. But yeah. Um, I think it'll just be good and hey. Anything to help our brand. That's all what I'm for. So y'all give me one second. Let me go get some rock. She's right here. And um I'll be right back. Give me one second. Are you gonna eat, little girl? Or you gonna lay down? You gonna eat that on? What you gonna do? Hmm? Hmm? What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? You gonna say hey to the game? She come in and she sit down. She noticed they right here. So she'll sit right there. That's why I got this pad right here. So she won't get all that on my floor and on my wall. So what she does, what she's waiting on me to do is to move them. So where they're laying right here, she can lay right here. And that her legs can go this way. Or she might want to come on this side. She cleaning up her mess. Yes, clean it up because I just changed your bed. What are you going to do? You're not going to go outside and eat June bugs. So now she's eating her food. Sarak is a real good mama. I don't have any issues with, you know, with Sarak. She'll lay there. She'll clean her baby. She, you know... Do what she do is just sometimes, you know, she can be a little ding dong, but you know, I can't blame it. Every, I mean, us humans, you know, you lay on one side for a long time, you get tired of laying right there too, and want to get up and switch to the other side. So, but that's about it. Other than that, and you know, she for the most part let us know when she got to go out, and even though she let us go out, sometimes she still don't want to go because she don't want to leave them, but you know. It is what it is. She's a good girl. She's always been a good mom. Um, I, I haven't had any issues with Sarah. So, and as you can see, they in her, they still sleep. Even though she came and sat literally right there next to them. They still sleep. And she eating her little food. What's she going to eat for? She's not going to, I don't expect her to, to kill all her food right now. I, I, I mean, I just don't. She's going to eat what she want to eat right now, and then she's going to come lay down. And then whatever she don't eat, she'll eat sometime through the night, or she'll get up and finish it in the morning. Um, it's all up to her, but she's going to eat what she's going to eat, and I'm going to let her eat what she's going to eat. So that way, when she does lay down for the night, I don't have to have any issues with her trying to hop up. She's drinking us some water. But yeah, y'all, I'm probably going to stay on about five more minutes. Because like I said, I have to go help Bae um, get Nikki cleaned up and do her transition to come in the house for the night and everything. And then I have to get the area in here set up for her. Um, so, and then I have to go ahead and get some rock back situated for the night.
um, before I go back outside. Um, so, I, I, get, that's not, why, why are you sitting on my phone? Come on, come on, come on, come on this side. Laying on this side for a long time, so come on this side. Sit, 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 sit down. Sit down, Swap. Sit down. Thank you. Thank you, fat girl. Oh, come on, lay down. Down there with her babies. Oh, shoot. So, as you can see, she laying back down. I'm not gonna move them. This one is woke. So, she probably lick it to death and lick the ones that sleep and go on to get them clean. And then, as they might stay asleep while she's licking them, I don't know, they might wake up and try to get up under her. Either way, it's fine with me. It don't really matter because she's doing what she's supposed to do. So, I'm going to go on and come out of here with her and let her do what she do. Uh, let her do what she do and I'll be back in here after a while to check on her. But I know she got it for right now. And uh, that's about it, gang. So... Uh, I might go live tomorrow, depending on how tired I am. Cause like I said, y'all know we just had Nikki's babies, and we gonna be taking turns back and forth. Uh, between Nikki and Sarah, making really, you know, mainly Nikki, just making sure that she's good and comfortable. Um, Sarah, for like I told y'all, for the most part, I don't really have to do too much too, because she's experienced. She knows what to do, and um. The babies, they'll let you know if something ain't right. But, um, yeah, you guys, so I got a long night ahead of me, especially the first, like, as y'all know, people that's had litters or breeders or whatever the case may be, you know, the first night, I don't care how good your dog is, how experienced she is, the first night is always the hardest. Um, from the delivery to the ending and normally yeah the ending is a lot better because you know they've been they're so exhausted from pushing and and just going through it <laughs> however long it takes them so um yeah the first night is gonna be a little worse but uh as the days go on and progress it gets a lot easier but it's still a job, and you're not just going to be sleeping, getting no beauty sleep with day-old puppies on the ground. <laughs> so, but yeah, you guys, like I said, I'm going to go ahead and end this live. I appreciate everybody for coming through. Thank you for everybody that supports us and all the love uh, you guys show us. Um, if we don't tell you enough, we thank you, we thank you, we thank you for all the love that you guys give us. Um... Also, if you're new to the channel or just stopping by and you have not hit that subscribe button, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Turn your post notification bell on to all, not personalized. Turn it on all so you don't miss anything that we drop. Make sure you hit that like, love button. Give us a thumbs up on every video that you see. Um, keep commenting. Keep sharing the video. You already know. Tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend to come join the BBK gang family. Come join the family, y'all. Also, don't forget about the raffle. Keep getting your raffle tickets. Raffle tickets are only $5. You can get as many as you want. You can get as many as you want. We only take cash out purchases for the raffle tickets, though, you guys. So if you don't have cash out, try to get cash out if you want to get in the raffle. Um, also... Before, 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 please listen to what I say. Before you send your cash out payment, you must get in contact with us, whether it's a DM on Instagram, whether you text us, 
or call us personally. It doesn't even matter. But make sure you call, text, or DM us before you send your cash out purchase. Because if you just send a purchase on cash out for the raffle, I will not enter you into the raffle. I'm sorry. And whatever you sent, I mean, that's, that's just going to be your loss. Because I'm not going to enter you into the raffle because I don't know who it is. And don't send in the memo of the cash out your uh, your information. Don't don't send it there. Send uh, a text message or a um, DM with your info, your name, your city, and your state, and how many tickets you're trying to purchase. If you're sending a DM from Instagram, make sure you include your phone number because if you win, and I just have a Instagram, yeah, I can call you from Instagram, but. We want to be able to call you personally, call your regular phone and get in contact with you and let you know that you are the winner. Y'all already know we might be doing two puppies. I don't know yet. We might be doing two, but we know for sure we're doing one. Um, we will have cash prizes for the people that do not win the pup. Don't ask me how much because I'm not sure yet because we keep switching it. But it's going to be, you know, still worth it. But... Again, y'all keep in your raffle tickets at 10K subscribers. We will be giving somebody a pup. So we're almost there, you guys. I'm going to see where we're at right now in real time so y'all can see how much further we have. Let me just refresh this right quick before I get off. So, this is where we're at. 8422, we're right, you know, right up under 1500 uh more subscribers that we need to be at 10k so y'all keep getting this there keep running it up keep telling a friend to tell a friend and hey somebody gonna be a winner but y'all i'm gonna go ahead and get off here for tonight thank y'all for all the love and support over here bbk gang we love y'all tune in i go live tomorrow i know i'm supposed to go live on saturdays but i don't know yet it just really depends on how i feel but y'all just stay tuned be looking out for the instagram because if, if we do if i do decide to go live i will post it on our story on instagram so go follow us on instagram at big boss rock wallet kennels hey and y'all have a good night we love y'all peace out